Greetings, my friends. Those who follow me for the last 10 years on social media know one of my favorite sayings is this is where the rubber hits the road. This truly is, my friends, as the title of this sermon says, no, it's not sermon, video. The title of this video says, imminent rapture warning so huge, words can't even describe it. You must watch and share. We fly soon. <laughs> this is just beyond huge. Told you in yesterday's video about the Feast of Trumpets coming up in a few weeks, uh, right about the time of Israel's election and some possible ramifications of that. I'll let you know about it. Told you so many things and about the rapture could be on any day that God is in charge. But listen to this. Check this out. Sanhedrin. I broke the news of Sanhedrin to you guys a couple years ago. I was a pioneer telling the world the Sanhedrin was back and the significance, the huge rapture significance, end time significance, tribulation significance, third temple significance of the Sanhedrin. And they're back. And guess what they're going to be doing now? You ready for this? At the Feast of Trumpets, the same week as the Feast of Trumpets in 2019, the Sanhedrin are going to hold an animal sacrifice where? On the Mount of Olives, the place where Jesus Christ is going to come back in the at the end of the tribulation and step his feet on it, and the mountain will split apart when he returns. Okay, you got that? Check out the, uh, the storyline on this. Nations are invited for animal sacrifice on the Mount of Olives, renewing Noah's covenant. Okay, Noah's covenant was it would never rain, it would never flood again to destroy the earth. But what is Noah a perfect example of? The rapture, the imminent rapture. God protected Noah and his family and the animals, took them away out of harm's way, put them in, in, in the cleft of the rock, and they were taken away while all hell broke loose on the world for a certain period of time. After that, then they came back. Out of the out of out of being and holding in the cleft, and came back on the earth. The true bride of Christ will be raptured out of here soon at the imminent rapture. We'll be kept safe for for seven pure years of hell and tribulation. We'll come back with Jesus Christ and be back on the earth again to help Him reign in the thousand year reign of Christ in millennium. Amazing stuff, my friends. But it, but it, it goes on, it gets better. This is going to be on September twenty fifth, which is the fifty seven hundred and eightieth anniversary of the day on which Jewish tradition holds the world was created. They think that's the day, by their calendar, which is different than ours, that's the day that God created the world. So God created the world, had Adam and Eve on earth. They sinned. He had to send his only son, Jesus Christ, had had the flood, send his only son, Jesus Christ, back, make a covenant with Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, okay? And the for the um, tribulation, the the seventh week of Daniel, had his only son, Jesus Christ, come come down to earth to live as man, as God-man, okay? And then he lived, died, was risen again, praise the Lord, went back to heaven to prepare a place for all of us. He's coming again soon at the imminent rapture. Again, see how this is all tying in? The Sahedrin is holding a conference for the emerging organization of 70 nations. That, that number 70. You got the number 70? 70 is a generation that will that will be that will live to see the imminent rapture. Praise the Lord. We're that generation right now. It's seventy years by the Jewish calendar right now, this year, since they became a nation. Forty eight. You getting all this? The conference will culminate in an animal sacrifice made by representatives of the nations on the Mount of Olives, in which they will renew the covenant made by Noah upon leaving the ark. This is just amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. I'm telling you right now. The rapture is imminent. Am I saying the rapture is going to be during that week? No. Am I saying it's going to be during the Feast of Trumpets? No. I'm saying it could be during that week, could be during the Feast of Trumpets, could be on that day, could be today, tomorrow, could be any day. I covered it in the video yesterday. If you missed it, watch it because it covers a lot of stuff. These two videos tie in closer together. God is showing us so many signs that are just going right over most people's heads. They don't see what's happening. I see it. He's given me a gift of discernment. It's all glory to Him, none to me. I'm telling you right now. We're in the last of the last of the last seconds of the last days in God's time. Jesus Christ is your only hope, my friends. If you've never been saved, you're backslidden. Pray the prayer. Do the six steps in a box blood video. No one's guaranteed more time in your life. And those who don't believe in the tribulation rapture, those who don't believe in repentance after salvation, when you're left behind, you'll believe then, won't you? Albeit too late. I don't want to see anyone spend forever languishing in hell in the lake of fire. I love you all so much, and I just pray that all of you get right with the Lord. Get your life right right now. Don't take any chances. Get it right right now. If you'd like prayer for anything, contact me. I'll pray for you daily. True Christians, look up 
Our redemption draweth nigh, my friends. We fly soon. Witness and pray in what little time we have left and all the time we have left, what little it is, to your loved ones, to the to, to strangers, to anyone you can, whatever way you can do it, do it. We are so close to getting out of here. I love you all so much. And just share this video. Show Christ you care. Share. Show, share all my videos, all my sermons. We are on the threshold of eternity. It's time to wake up right now before your time runs out. Please, 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 I beg all of you who don't believe in the rapture, pre-tribulation pre pre rapture, all you don't believe in repentance after salvation, understand that God's word says both of those things are true. I don't want to see you miss the rapture and end up in hell, the lake of fire, or left behind in your best case scenario and going through all the suffering when you can be ready for heaven right now. I love you all so much again. May God bless you. Look up again, true Christians. Our different draw tonight. We fly soon. Share this video. Show Christ you care. Share. 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 Get the word out. Have your friends share. Those friends share and so on. May God bless you. Bye.